What's up guys? In the first lesson, we will focus on the basic configuration of KW Hotel 3. So when you install KW Hotel 3 for the first time and you launch it, you will see this screen and it asks you for the username and password. And if you look below, you have this message that tells you that if you write admin and no password at all, this will allow you to log in. Uh, this is frequently uh, asked by our customers who start program for the first time and they don't know how to how to deal with this. So uh, admin and no password. Uh, if you don't want KW Hotel to log you out, uh, you can click the option keep me logged in. Uh, and well, let's continue. We click here and now you are asked for the email address. And this email address is used to remind you your password if you lose it at any point, okay? So uh, in the free version, you can only have a single account. It's always the administrator. But if you have the standard or pro version, you can have multiple accounts for your receptionist, for administrators, for housekeeping staff, and so on. And if some of your, one of your uh, colleagues loses his password, this is the way to go. So I advise you to write this email address I won't do it right now, uh, but later on, I will also show you how to create a password for your administrator to protect your database better. So right now I'm writing nothing and I click uh, cancel. <laughs> okay, next you are asked by KW Hotel, what is your preferable way of displaying information? Basically, which calendar would you prefer? I will explain both the calendar and the dashboard modules in the separate videos. For now, for the purpose of this tutorial, we will focus on the reservation calendar. So this is what we click here. And now we are waiting. The database is being created. Uh, give me a while, just <laughs> uh, fix my microphone a bit. Okay, and now you are in the so-called wizard. Uh, Wizard is the place where you can configure the major options of KW Hotel. Basically, when you are done with this, you can start working. But of course, as you will see in the future videos, uh, going through the wizard is just the first step if you want to maximize the performance that you can get with KW Hotel 3. So, first of all, uh, this is a nostalgic choice, let's say, for me. Uh, here you can choose the theme of your KW Hotel. And previous KW Hotel versions usually always had the blue version. So uh, I will stick to blue because I'm here since 2013. So I've been here, here for quite a long time. And as I said, for the nostalgic reasons, I select blue. So then we click next. And right now you are asked about the location of your hotel. So uh, I will pick United Kingdom uh, for my dream hotel. But uh, honestly, we as a developer of KW Hotel Team are located in Poland, in Krakow, basically. Uh, then you can select the tax for your room rates, meals, and products. Uh, basically, whatever amount, whatever percentage you insert here uh, will mean that this percentage is price included. So if you have a 10% room, uh, room rate tax, this means that if you have a room that costs 50 euro, this is tax included, okay? Uh, if you want a tax mm, not included in the room rate, but instead you want it added on top of the room rates price, I will show you how to do it in a different video. Uh, and for meals and products, this is always uh, tax included. Mm, then you can also use the fractional tax, which means you can have like a 10.5 uh, percentage of tax. And the last but not least, you have the currency. Uh, you have some predefined options like Euro, USD, British Pounds, and so on. But if there is any currency you may have in your country and it's not listed here, uh, what you have to do is simply write it. So let's say Mama. Sorry, it's Mom in Polish. This is my creativity, as you will see later on. Uh, but whatever you write here and you save these changes, this currency will continue to be used throughout the KW Hotel, okay? So in my case, I will stick to Euro, and then we click Next. And this is all for this video. In the next one, we will create room groups for your hotel, and I will tell you why they are so essential to use, not only for KW Hotel's sake, but also, also for the sake of making your work 
more efficient, faster, and simply better. Okay, so see you there.